Hello, um, I'd like to talk about 2009. Um, I'd like to talk about the coming uh, economic destruction in 2009. Um, I'd like to talk about the increase in X-class solar flares. Um, in 2009, um, for you who don't know what an X-class uh, flare is, is when the sun um, goes crazy and starts igniting these things called the uh, solar flares. And they're just basically like um, it's shooting out uh, hot fire uh, out into the, a wave of fire into the, uh, onto the earth. And the earth's... Uh, um, the Earth's uh, actually kind of gets affected by the X-class flares. Uh, in a spiritual way, basically, the Sun is cradling the Earth. But anyways, um, there will be a massive, massive, massive amounts of X-class flares. And this is good news. Um, the bad news is um, there's going to be a lot of destruction economically in the world. Um, there's going to be a serious economic, uh, uh, man-made, um, uh, sort of a man-caused, uh, uh, I guess uh, I guess some people call it a false flag or something like that, um, uh, and it's going to bring down uh, uh, the system. And uh, there's going to be a lot of rioting in the streets, in the world. There's going to be a lot of hungry people. There's going to be a lot of death. Um, there's definitely going to be a lot of uh, fighting and dis unrest. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if martial law were enacted. I wouldn't be surprised if... Um, well, actually, if people saw Planet Nibiru coming around the corner, that, that would probably freak them out, too. But uh, many, many other things that are going to be happening this year in coinc coinc a coincidence with the aliens coming uh, this year, um, it will definitely be, <laughs> it'll be much, much more uh, un- Let's see, uh, uncovered, I would think. Uh, right now, there's a lot of things in the air. Uh, I'm not sure if you know what chemtrails are, but chemtrails uh, serve uh, a multitude of, uh, multitude of um, uh, uh, they serve as, number one, to disconnect humanity from the loving force by polluting the, the, the rain and the, you know, the, the ingredients of chemtrails are really toxic to the human body. So when it rains and you soak this up, it's not good for you. The second thing is to hide hide the um, top secret um, military aircraft. But another reason is to hide the alien, uh, the alien visitations, the aliens, uh, the UFOs or whatever, the um, grays and all that. Um, and then the other reason is to um, block out the sunlight. <laughs> um, uh, the sunlight is uh, again comes um, is, is is the loving force, and it is part of the loving force, and it's trying to reconnect humanity. But when you block this out, you just kind of have a dreary, depressed kind of people. So basically, um, 2009. Uh, there will be man-made wars, man-made control, man-made economic destruction, um, and even man-made diseases running amok. So I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if this year, um, uh, I wouldn't say stock up on food. I wouldn't say prepare yourself this way or that way, because I, I really see humans being really kind of. Uh, well, uh, I would say uh, it's coming soon, so, you know, it's coming within the next six months, so I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't worry too much about uh, preparing for anything, because it's, uh, by the time that you're all prepared and ready to go, it's gonna probably be already there, so, I think, uh, 
I think um, humanity is in for a, a definite ride, a definite roller coaster. And I'm not sure how to uh, give any advice on that.